Did you know? The instructions executed by ACPU are not the exact ones you write. Take a simple assembly addition instruction you might write. Do you think the CPU really only executes one add instruction internally? Not at all. When modern CPUs execute this instruction, they break it down into approximately four micro operations via the instruction decoder. This is the key to achieving high performance. Why break it down? Because modern CPUs are extremely complex, featuring a superscalar architecture. Take the Intel i9 as an example. It has eight integer execution ports, three floating point execution ports, paired with a deep pipeline of around 20 stages, register, renaming, in an out of order execution engine. If complex CISC instructions were processed directly, the idle rate of execution units would exceed 60%, resulting in severe waste of hardware resources. Therefore, during the decoding stage, the CPU splits one instruction into three to six small micro operations. At this decoding stage, the CPU's main decoder and secondary decoders work in coordination. For this added ton instruction, it is split into four micro operations. The split micro operations then enter the scheduler, which dynamically distributes them to idle ports based on the load of execution units for parallel execution. This allows the instruction level parallelism to reach four to six micro operations per cycle. Even for more complex instruction, the CPU can split into dozens of micro operations. To speed things up further, both Intel and AMD have even integrated a micro operations cache into their CPUs. With this cache, the same instruction does not need to be resplit every time it is executed. Instead, the pre-split micro operations can be directly fetched from the cache, reducing latency by dozens of clock cycles instantly. So here's the truth. The instructions you write are superficial, while the micro operations executed by the CPU are the real ones.